So guys, today I'm going to talk about the, um, there's basically a glitch currently in Fallout 4 whereby you can get infinite caps. Now, you can get enough caps walking around the wasteland and you can get enough caps just by selling and buying stuff. So there's no need to cheat. But I've been asked this a lot, so I thought, let me just kind of go over it anyway. But I'm not going to go through the gameplay because I don't condone it. Fallout 4 is easy enough to get caps hoard everything sell it you, there's no need to really in my opinion but if you want to get weapons early on what you need to do is you need to make your way towards diamond city so as you can see my map scrolling down there it is that's where you need to head to head to diamond city now there's a trader there um his name um i believe is r toro or something along those lines and he's like every other trader has lots of stuff with him and what you want to do is you want to start or initialize the trade as soon as you initialize the trade go to his ammo types uh, pick one of his ammos uh, 10 mil would be fine yeah just, just basically any ammo and what you do is you purchase all of his ammo and then do not f finalize that purchase just yet or well, instead access your item so that's l2 on the ps4 and sell a single unit of ammo back to him just a single unit then sell any of the remainder ammo type as well so there's a bug in that um, transaction basically what it does it keeps a single unit of ammo in your inventory so what you can do is you can carry on selling that single unit to him what it does is then gives you lots and lots of caps therefore what you can do with all those caps is purchase some of his more expensive gear um, weapons and then kind of just do a trade so you're pretty much buying stuff for free off of him by just giving him the single piece of ammo back um, I personally am not a fan of cheating especially not with a game like this there's so much to do you can easily hoard you can easily get stuff so there is no need to kind of show you guys the other that the other thing I want to talk about briefly is anyone playing on the PC you have the ability to go to the developers room the developer's room is amazing, but again, it's a cheat, and I don't condole it. So just what you do is hit the tilde key, and you type in the following letters. Um, I don't believe it's case sensitive, but you just put in C. So Charlie, Oscar, Charlie, Spacebar, Quebec, Alpha, Sierra, Mike, Oscar, Kilo, Echo. Hit return. That takes you into the developer's room. That gives you early access to pretty much everything you want. So all the weapons, the armor suits, um, anything that Fallout 4 doesn't give you access to just yet because obviously you haven't powered up enough and of course we haven't come across stuff like that. So, But personally, there is, again, there's no need to do that. You get minigun very early on. I've also posted a video where you can get a fat man early on and a nuke so you can have nuclear weapon. So there is no need to do that, but it's it's a good little wander around. It's like a ghostly little room. Have a little wander. Once you're in there, you'll be stuck and you'll be like, I need to get back out. So you hit the tilde key again, and then you key in the following. So you put in Charlie Oscar Echo, space bar, the number one, space bar, number one. That will take you back out of the developer's room and back into the normal game. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I won't be posting more cheats or anything because the game, there is enough in the game to keep you guys going. Um, it's There's no need to basically. But I hope you enjoyed it. I know I'm getting a lot of questions for it. So there it is.